Hey guys, it's Lexis. Okay, so, sorry, I, I didn't know I hit record. That's why there was that, like, pause. But anyway, so I'm gonna show you guys what I bought from Walmart. And here's my receipt. Um, I spent $47.44 there. And I, that's why I'm wearing, because I, I don't wear this much makeup normally. I just will probably put some, like, mascara on and that'll be it. But I was playing in my makeup today. So that's why, boom full face of makeup but okay anyway so some of the things I got I've never tried before and some of the things I got like I know they're good so let's see first thing that I got I got was this it is black radiance pressed powder Ooh, and like I got this and I got it in a darker shade because I was looking for bronzer, because everybody talks about bronzer, so I wanted to try it, but the bronzer, I, I think it was expensive, because, like, I'm a frugal person, and so this was, like, a couple bucks, and I was like, okay, I'll just use this, no big deal, and, um, I like this. I actually wish I would have gotten it my color so that I could put it on my face, because this is this is really cool, but anyway, I got it in the, in the color Creamy Beige. So there's that. And then I got this CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous 3-in-1 Foundation plus and, 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 and other stuff. But anyway, um, I got this in the color Golden Tan. And, like, I like it. But, and, like, a little bit goes a super long way. But I think I got the wrong color. Because, like, dude, I, I feel like it's too light. Do you think my face is lighter than my, like, neck? Cause like I feel like I I couldn't tell which color was mine, and because I don't normally I don't buy this stuff normally. I, I never really wear foundation, and but I don't know. I was looking in the mirror and like I don't know. It just maybe I I, I try to blend it really well, but did it work? Tell me it worked. Lie to me. Tell me it worked. But anyway, yeah I I like this. So there was that, and then. Okay, I was, I was like, I was on a budget, and the mascara that I wanted, I couldn't, like, I couldn't get it, because if I got that, I would have to put two items away, and so I saw this, it was like, extra, wow, lash, from Rimmel London, get the London look, and I saw this, and I, I don't remember how much this was, this was, this was like, really cheap, um... It was $3.47, which is, like, the cheapest mascara that I saw. And, like, this is actually what I'm wearing right now. Do you like it? I was like, what? You know, this is, like, a really good mascara, and it's, like, under $4. So, I don't know if you can, like, I don't know if you can, like, see. But I don't know if you can, like, because it, like, makes my eyelashes look really long. And it's, like, it looks like this. Yeah, so there's this. Um, and then I, oh, I just, I left my makeup bag in San Diego, which is one of the reasons why I went uh, makeup shopping. Um, I went to go visit my sister, I left all my makeup at her house. And so I threw, like, makeup I already had in here. But this is what I'm wearing right now on my lips. <laughs> but it rubbed off all the writing. I don't know if you can see. So I, I can't even tell what these are. I think like one of them is almond and one of them is like rose. I don't know the brand or anything. I'm sorry. This is what I'm wearing on my lips. Um, yeah. And uh, I just had this LA color thing in luscious wine. I'm not wearing this, but I can be. Mm. Okay. Now I'm wearing almond, luscious wine, and rose. Mm. Okay. So there's that. And this is baby lips. Okay. So I wanted it because it says, I don't know if you see, it says, Dr. Rescue. Don't look at my nails. Don't look at my nails. I was dyeing my grandma's hair and like it got all up under my nails. And so it looks like I have dirty, nasty, funky nails. But it's just dying. It won't come off, I promise. But anyway... Um, and I have, like, old white nail polish that I had on. My nails are funky. Don't look at them. Okay, but anyway, I got this baby lips. And it smells like, I don't know what it's called, the, uh, 
methanol. It smells like, it smells like kind of like, kind of like icy hot. Um, I don't know. I don't know how to describe this, but it, it feels, I feel like healing powers and I feel like it's working. I put this on like 30 minutes before I started putting on my makeup to try to like soften up my lips and okay. So there's that. Uh, already had these just basic Dollar Tree eyelash curlers. Um, okay, this. This is e.l.f. HD blush. Okay, I'm wearing it right now. See, this looks kind of like, it's okay, but do you see? Like, I, I wanted a darker blush for cheap, and this was three bucks. So I saw it, and I was like, okay, I'm game. I'll try it. But like, like, no, don't buy it. Like, I can't even express to you. I put, it comes like this little, a blob on on your finger and you rub it in and I've never had a blush like that before and like yesterday I put it on and a tiny bit and I was rubbing in it and it was just smearing everywhere I look like a freaking clown like it was just going f everywhere and my cheeks were just like I couldn't I like I was putting like foundation over it and I was like trying to blend it in my best friend was like sitting over there and he was just laughing at me like uh Alexis you don't know what you're doing and it's just like no I know what I'm doing I promise well I'm trying to like hurry up and blend all this stuff out never again ever again so that was my little rant on this the elf HD blush not my favorite it's a pretty color and if you used a very tiny bit it kind of looks okay, but yeah, I got this e.l.f. brush. I really like this brush. It's really soft. Okay. <laughs> I'm so weird. You're going to learn that. Okay. And then I got this cheaper e.l.f. brush. The other one was $3. This one was $1 because, like I said, I was on a budget. And this is just for Brondo. So there, I got that. And the $3 one is a lot better. But And then I have this NYX blush. It's in the color cinnamon. Mm. And yeah. And then I have this e.l.f. Clarif this clarifying pressed powder from e.l.f. And it's in the color, I don't know, it's in the color ivory. And basically when I'm done with my makeup, cause like I, I never use liquid foundation. So I, I bought this, it was a dollar and I figured like I could just put it on top of it and like I won't look oily or anything. And I think it worked. I feel like it worked. I hope it worked. I don't know. It was dollars, so. And then, here. Hold on. I feel like, I feel like I'm going to get my lipstick all over my teeth. So I have makeup wipes that I was using earlier. It's all dried now. But just. Okay. Look at all that. Oh. I feel so much better. Because I, I, I feel like. Anyway. Oh. I didn't. I was using this because like my skin felt really really dry. So this is Neutrogena Age Defense. I didn't just buy this. My mom gave it to me. So she lives in Arizona. So she gave this to me a very long time ago. Um, I bought these Shine Eraser. They were a dollar. They're e.l.f. I've never used them before so hopefully they do what they say they're going to. And then I have LA Colors Eyeliner and Eyeshadow. Oh this is an eyeshadow? I thought this was two different eyeliners that makes sense no wonder the white one's not the same consistency as the black one gotta read what you're getting but anyway i got this a long time ago it, i got it from the dollar tree um yeah like i said i have other makeup that wasn't from walmart thrown in this bag so this is just one of them um i have this i love this this is the maybelline new york cover stick correct concealer uh, it's in the yellow, the yellow one. I put this underneath my eyes. I like it. Um, it doesn't, like, it, it makes a good difference, but it doesn't make, like, I don't know. It doesn't make it really, like, stand out to where you can see, like, the creases and the cakiness. I feel like it's, I feel like it's good. Muy bien. Okay. I'm gonna have this Mega Plump Mascara from Wet n Wild. I haven't tried it yet. Um... But it was cheap, so I want to try it. I want to find good dupes, like cheap mascaras that work. It just looks like this. Um, yeah. Then I have this other e.l.f. brush. This one was a dollar as well. I just use this for 
my um, eyeshadow. Why, why was I going to say mascara? I don't know what I'm doing. Anyway, I don't know wh what this stuff is. It's just stuff that people put on their face. So, but anyway, I have tweezers. Um, I think that's, oh. And then the last thing that I have is this little e.l.f. Uh, flawless eyeshadow. I'm trying to read it in my phone. So, oh, and I'm sorry if, like, the quality is kind of bad, too. This is the front camera. Um, it's, like, two megapixels, I think. I don't know. Don't quote me on that. I'm really bad at, like, megapixels and techno stuff. Anyway, I got um, these colors. These colors are really pretty. Like, I don't, well, I mean, I don't want them to fall out. That would just suck on my grandma's couch. But anyway, they're like these. And they're like shimmery. I was trying to find matte colors, but I, I couldn't. All of these have like some sort of shimmer in them. Well, these two, these two don't. Oh, don't look at my nails. Oh my gosh, I'm going to have to cut my nails because that dye is just not coming out. But... Anyway, that's the last thing I bought from Walmart. And, um, like I said, some of these things I haven't tried yet. Um, but things I have tried, everything besides that blush. That blush. Mm, that blush has got to go. Anyway, besides that, like, all of them are good. Super good. But, yeah. So. How are you? Okay, I, my grandma, my grandma went to Vegas. So, I'm in the house alone for, like, I don't know, a couple days. And she does this a lot, like, she loves Vegas. And so, just talking to my camera in the living room, all alone. My friend wanted me to come over, him and his brother are playing video games, which I'm gonna do next, because why not? Who doesn't like... He's my PlayStation, that's another thing. I've been playing Minecraft recently, and, like, I, w I was so proud of my house. And I was like, oh, I have this barn, I have this house, I have the, all these things, because, like, I'm really new to Minecraft. And I was like, man, this looks freaking legit. Can't wait to show my best friend. His name is James. And, like, and then I, I saw on YouTube that there was, like, Minecraft, like, people on YouTube. And, like, their stuff was sick. And I was like, oh, my stuff isn't that good. And so... That was a complete tangent. What was I talking about? Oh, I was talking about me being alone. I think I'm going crazy because I don't have anybody to talk to. And like, yeah. Anyway, so have a good day. <laughs> okay, bye guys.